Please don't forget to like this video and if you haven't done so already, click the subscribe button, then click the bell and then click all. Every like and subscribe helps us make more great videos for you. This guide shows you how to clean up your 4K Fire TV stick. Now, first thing you need to do is grab your remote control, press and hold the picture of the house on the remote control until this appears, then let go, and then go across to settings just there. Once settings is highlighted, press the middle button on the remote control. Go to display and audio. Once that's highlighted, press the middle button on the remote control, and then make sure that screen is highlighted. Now, this is actually optional, but it does tend to save quite a bit of space by turning off the screen saver on your Fire TV stick. So once that's highlighted, press the middle button on the remote control. Okay, and here we go down to start time home. Once that's highlighted, press the middle button on the remote control. Change that to never. So highlight never, press the middle button on the remote control. Then go down to start time apps and content. Again, press the middle button on the remote control. Once that's highlighted, you can go down to never again, press the middle button on the remote control. And I think that's it for here. We can turn these off if you want to but it doesn't really matter to be quite honest with you so i'm just going to press the back button on the remote control twice and then we need to go to applications here so once we've gone into applications press the middle button on the remote control go down to manage installed applications press the middle button on the remote control and have a look here through some of the apps and if there's any on here that you don't use anymore then highlight it press the middle button on the remote control and then go to uninstall okay let the program or app uninstall the other thing you need to do is go through the apps here and go to clear cache so clear the cache for each one of these apps so go down don't hit clear data because if you hit clear data then you are going to end up having to reset up the app. So just go to clear cache. So like you say, you can go down to all them. One of them in particular that I would say to make sure that you clear is screensaver. And in actual fact, go down to screensaver, highlight that, press the middle button on the remote control, highlight full stop, press the middle button on the remote control, go to clear cache there, press the middle button on the remote control and go up to clear data and press, clear, press the middle button on the remote control and then press it again, again to clear data, but only do that on screen saver. So once you've gone through this list, you've cleared the cache on all of them, removed anything that you don't need. There may be some things on here that you can't uninstall. Some of the Alexa and Amazon stuff, if we go into that, there's no option there to uninstall that. Unfortunately, not much you can do about that apart from clear the cache. Next thing we wanna do is we wanna go to find just there and then down to search, press the middle button on the remote control and we wanna search for a, an app called Total Command. So as we're typing it, hopefully it should come up. So uh, let's just carry on typing. So it's total space commander. And as you can see there, there you go. Total commanders appeared. Once that appears, go down, highlight it, press the middle button on the remote control. Make sure that this icon is highlighted. Press the middle button on the remote control and then press the middle button again to start downloading. Now this bit might take a bit of time. Just depends on the speed of your internet connection. There you go. Mine's downloaded. It's now installing and it's now ready. So we can press the middle button on the remote control to open Total Commander. Now you must make sure that you allow Total Commander to access photos, media and files on your device. If you've said deny to this, then you need to uninstall Total Commander and reinstall it again and then select allow. So I'm going to make sure that allow selected. Yep. There we go. Press the middle button on the remote control. Go down to downloaded files just there. Press the middle button on the remote control. And if there's anything in here, you can actually delete that. So just once when you highlight something, just press and hold the middle button on the remote control. This screen comes up, go down to delete, press the middle button on the remote control and then press it again to confirm you want to delete it. And there we go. It's deleted. Go into any yellow folders that are here on the left. So there's nothing in there. And if I go into the file link folder there, ah, there's something in there. So like I say, that is a download file. We don't need to keep download files. So just press and hold the middle button on the remote control, go down to delete and uh, press the middle button again and press it again 
to confirm and there you go it's gone press the go up to the arrow there press the middle button on the remote control go up to the arrow again press the middle button on the remote control now if you've got downloader installed you will also have a yellow folder titled downloader so highlight downloader press the middle button on the remote control if there's anything in there delete out anything that's in there so again i've got this in here so i highlight it press the middle button on the remote control go down to delete press the middle button on the remote control and press it again and you might find in, in the download or the downloader folder that you might have the same file time and time again, maybe where you've re-downloaded it or maybe where an app has updated itself. B and Nova tend to do that. They tend to update themselves and leave their old files here in the download folder, which builds up over time. And once you've got sort of more than 10 copies in there, that's taking up quite a bit of space. So press the picture of the house on the remote control. And if you want to get rid of Total Commander to free up even more space, press and hold the picture of the house on the remote control until this appears then go across to apps once apps is highlighted press the middle button on the remote control find total commander just there and then press the three lines just on the remote control there and then go down to uninstall just on the right there press the middle button on the remote control go down to uninstall there press the middle button on the remote control and after a few seconds that will disappear so there you go. That guide showed you probably one of the best ways to clear out your 4K Fire Stick to give you even more space. I hope this guide helps. And if you've got any comments about this or any other ideas, then please feel free to comment below. Thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech. That's at CWTech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.